This video will show how to easily retrofit an 8-foot fluorescent fixture into an energy-saving LED light fixture using the ETI 4 and 8-foot LED retrofit kit and four 4-foot four ETI LED tubes, which are sold separately. With safety in mind, our first step is to turn off the power. Next, we'll remove the existing fluorescent tubes from the fixture we're updating. Please recycle these tubes in accordance with local municipal requirements. Now we'll remove the ballast covers, exposing the interior of the fixture for an easy retrofit. Remove the center mount in the middle of the fixture. At this point, we'll disconnect the hot and neutral or black and white wires. Cut the wires on both ends of the ballast. Then physically remove the ballast. Please recycle the ballast in accordance with local municipal requirements. Last, we'll remove both socket kits from each end of the fixture using a flathead screwdriver. Now we're ready to retrofit. Take the bracket kit and break it into its three distinct parts, the center and two ends. Please note that our kit accommodates both four and five inch fluorescent fixture widths. Our LED tubes require power to just one end, so we suggest you wire the center sockets and use jumper cables to jump between the first, second, third, and fourth sockets for both the white and black wires. Use solid copper wires as your jumper cables. Now we'll install the lead black and white wires that will later be connected to the wires in the outlet box. Next, install the ends. Because power is required to just one end of the tubes, these are basically placeholders or dead ends. Use the included self-tapping screws to secure them to the fixture. Now connect the lead wires to the wires from the outlet box using wire nuts. Black to black, white to white. Then tuck the wires up into the fixture. Pressure fit the center mount to the fixture. To ensure the center sockets are at the proper distance from the ends, take one of the LED tubes and use it as a guide. Adjust the location of the center mount as needed. Use the self-tapping screws to secure it in place. Place the warning label within the fixture to alert future users that this fixture has been retrofitted to use only LED tubes. Now, reinstall the ballast covers. Note the Power This End label on each LED tube. Be sure to place those ends into the center power carrying sockets. Now you can turn the power back on, and when you flip the switch, your ETI LED retrofit is ready to go. You now have 60 watts of input power that equal 150 watts of fluorescent light, up to 7,600 lumens of combined light output when using four LED tubes. The fixture works with voltages from 120 to 277 volts. This is a 50,000 hour rated product with a five year warranty and should last approximately 46 years. Estimated energy costs are $7.23 per year and will save up to $495 over the life of the fixture.